All right, so now let's try this uh, with a uh, with a lithium and sulfur. Um, so lithium is in group one. It wants to lose one electron, so it's going to farm lithium plus. Sulfur is in group six and wants to gain two electrons. So again, look at the group number at the top of the column. Um, the one that's in uh, Roman numerals tells you uh, how many electrons it wants to gain or lose, at least for main group elements. Um, so sulfur is going to be minus two. So we'll do our crossover method, and we're going to end up with Li2S is the compound that forms. Is this charge neutral? We have two lithium atoms, each lose one electron. That's two electrons lost from lithium. Then we have sulfur, which gains two electrons. That's two electrons gained. So that um, equals the ones lost, so it is charge neutral. Okay, I'll do one more example. We're going to make a compound with aluminum and oxygen. Now, aluminum is in group three, which means it wants to lose three electrons to form Al3+. Um, so aluminum is a metal, even though it's kind of at the middle of the table. It's got slightly less than um, four electrons, um, which is half of uh, eight. Um, so it wants to lose electrons, not gain them. Um, oxygen is in group six and wants to gain two electrons. Um, so oxygen forms a um, charge of two minus. So we cross over and we have Al2 O3. So this is the compound that forms. We can check um, whether uh, electrons are gained or lost, uh, and it ends up charge neutral. Um, so we have three oxygens with two electrons gained. That's uh, six electrons total. And aluminum, there's two of them, and each loses three. So two times three is six lost. So um, we do have a charge neutral compound. All right, and I just want to show you um, Lewis diagrams. Um, so it's a little bit busier here because there's like um, quite a few um, atoms involved. But if you look at it, um, aluminum's got these six electrons here and it loses them all and they all end up with oxygen. So it just kind of shows you that um, it still works out even when it's like more atoms involved like this. And then uh, at the bottom here we have the um, Lewis structure of the compound which is 2Al3+, plus, and then we have a 3, and from the oxygen, because there's three of them, and then the um, electrons are associated with oxygen, so we put that in brackets, and then it's 2 minus. And the uh, formula, again, is Al2O3.